Okay, uh, Terry, we're just up in your roof area here. I thought I'd give you a bit of a look at what you've got. It's um, very traditional post-war hardwood framed um, pumped in mulch insulation with terracotta roof tiles. Uh, the workmanship and the quality of the hardwood timbers is um, I always get amazed when I come up here. It's, it's quite stunning. Just the uh, I see the durability of the timber and, and, and how it's done. It's uh, a testament to uh, their workmanship and skill. So uh, the front half has got all your original portion of the property and the hardwoods. And then you go to the back down there, Terry, and you've got your pine truss. That's the addition. So it's engineered a little bit differently. And uh, you do have the insulation right throughout, or what I can see. You know, just can't get into that back half just with access, with the framing and whatnot. But you can see all of it. Um, now, just with these um, hardwoods, what you find... And of course, bearing in mind I've been around for uh, you know six decades, is you get a little bit of an unevenness in some of the timbers. You can see if I just go that vertical timber on a lean there going up, it's going down towards that V is there. And if you follow that up to that bit of timber there, compare it to the one that's a bit closer, and you can see at this end here there's a gap. And as you go along, that gap gets smaller because it's not quite level horizontally. So you get a little bit of waviness in the roof tiles, but they're very heavy. But as I say, when you consider they've been here for so long and still standing and still in a position which is you know very sturdy um, more than acceptable